Hey Jam, if you're new to my channel, welcome. My name is Ohima Bonsu. If you're a returning subscriber, thank you so much for clicking to watch this video. So Fenty Beauty has some new product out. So I decided to go ahead and do a full face of Fenty Beauty and show you guys what minis they have out and to show you how we could use them for the summer. So they sent me over a package with a fanny pack. So let's jump into it. Okay, so first I'm going to start with the Fly Baby set. So now the Fly Baby set has the eyeliner and the eye primer. And that set retails for $24. So I'm going to go ahead and take the mini eye primer in the set. And I'm going to use that to go ahead and prime my eyelids RV. And I'm going to blend it in with my finger. I, I really like blending my eye primers in with my finger. I don't know why. And my eyes are a little stained from that pink eye look I did this was literally like six hours after I did that look that's why my eyes are still a little tainted so there's also a pro filter mini instant retouch primer and that retails for $16 but I don't want to open the box because I already have two full-size primers I'm going in with the Fenty Beauty foundation in the shade 480. I also went ahead and mixed it with a foundation that was a little bit more golden because if I do full coverage, 480 comes off a little too red on me. So I mix it with something else so that I can, it can give me that perfect shade that I'm looking for. If you haven't seen my video on how I customize my two red foundations to match my skin tone, I will put that link down below in the description box. So I'm going in with the Pro Filter Concealer and I'm using the shade 480 and I apply that to my face. 480 is a beautiful, beautiful golden shade and I always forget to just put the 490 before I put 480 and my face looks a little bit too golden for me. But it is not a bad glow, okay? I would prefer a golden concealer any day okay so i went ahead and i blended it out with the dark skin makeup beauty sponge it's very soft it blends everything out beautifully okay so i went ahead and applied some of the concealer on my eyelids and i blended that out so that i can have a more even eyelid shade to apply my eyeshadow. Okay, so there's also a mini Pro Filter Instant Retouch Setting Powder, and that setting powder retails for $18. Look at that size compared to the big size. I feel like the, and I'm using the shade Coffee, I'm sorry, I'm using the shade Coffee, but I also feel like the mini sizes are perfect for you to put in your travel bag so that you don't have to lug around all the full size products because, you know, when you're packing, you just don't have enough space. So the mini products are a genius idea, by the way. Good job, Fenty. So I'm just applying that to my face and it just blends beautifully into my complexion. Okay, so I know this palette has been out for a while, but I have yet to use mine. So I'm using the Moroccan Spice Palette. Okay, so first I'm taking that red shade and applying that all over my eyelids. And I'm just blending it in really, really nicely so that it just looks beautiful and blended and even. So I'm not packing it on. Today, I am just swiping it on so that it comes out beautifully. But look at how pigmented this is. I'm taking that shimmer shade and applying that to my eyelids. I didn't know that the glitters in there or the, the specks of shimmer in there would fall on my face. If I did, I would have done my eyes first. But you guys, it got all over my face and I was just trying to take it off. It took me forever. I had to go ahead and reapply concealer to get that off my face. So I went ahead and applied some more of that shimmer shade with the brush to give me a more precise um, blend. And then I just couldn't resist it. I took the blue, I took the blue shade that was in there and I applied it over the gold. And that gave me a silvery blue kind of look. Even though I liked it, I went ahead and also applied the gold shade directly over it again. So it could be like a silvery goldish kind of look. 
it was it was a process but i finally got exactly what i was looking for and this is what i was looking for it's very pretty it's not too gold it's not too silver it's just perfect I went ahead and applied some of our first transition shade on my lower eyelids and I blended that out to meet the top of my eyes and everything. Just make make sure it looks uniform and flows very nicely, okay? And then I went ahead and magically applied my brows you know <laughs> it was so cute i just had to show you guys this transition i really love it so i went back into the fly baby mini set and i took the eyeliner that comes in the set and i went ahead and lined my eyes with that if you just in case you forgot the fly baby mini set retails for 24 dollars, and i went ahead and lined my eyes Okay, you guys, I was just feeling myself because I haven't done a natural neutral look in a while. I'm taking that white shade that's in the palette. Use that in my inner corner because I wanted my inner corner highlighter to be significantly a different shade compared to the shimmer shade on my eyes. So there is a mini bronzer set, retails for $24, except the bronzer that came in the, in the set that I have was not Mocha Mami. So I went ahead and used a full size Mocha Mami on my face and I blended that into my skin. Just make sure that essentially it's more of a blush on me, not like a bronzer type, but I already have a video on that if you haven't seen it. I will also link that down below in the description box so you can see how exactly it looks on my skin. Okay, so this is the Lil Bronzer Duo, and that bronzer in there was actually um, significantly lighter, so I didn't use the bronzer. I went ahead and took the matchstick that came in that set. This matchstick is the shade Cinnamon with an S, and I applied that with my finger on the parts of my face that I'm going to highlight my face and after I finished that I went over it with the highlighter duo afternoon snack and mo honey these are my absolute favorite um, Fenty highlighter duo and you guys I just absolutely love how this looks on my skin Okay, so I went in with a matte moselle, a full size matte moselle. However, they have matte moselle minis that retail for $19 for two. So if you've ever wanted to try the matte moselles, then this is a perfect time to try because you can get two minis for $19. Okay, so I'm using the shade PMS because I swatched it and I really love how PMS looked on my skin tone so i went ahead and applied that all over my lips it's like i i have all kinds of feelings for this shade okay just just look how pretty it looks on me i love it i love the shade that's literally all i did so i will put all the products that i use down below in the description box let me know down below in the comments how you like this i know a few people have been requesting a more natural look so i hope this is natural enough and not too much of a color for you thank you guys so much for watching this video if you did enjoy it don't forget to leave me a big thumbs up also make sure you subscribe to my channel and click that notification bell and select the option all so you get notified every time i upload a video
Thank you guys so much for watching. I love you guys so much. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.